quite high. And then the big thing we're talking about in the tropics, potential tropical cyclone nine. There is some dry air that it's fighting. It has not developed just yet, but it probably will pretty soon. So here's the forecast path, and this is not set in stone, but the general idea is to continue moving to the west northwest around a ridge of high pressure out here to the north, getting near possibly Cuba after getting near Hispaniola Thursday into Friday. Then it may take this jog to the northwest and then curve to the north, and that would be this weekend, maybe Sunday into Monday. Notice the computer models are in pretty good consensus, although these will change a bit as the system has not formed yet, but taking it maybe right toward Florida, perhaps, maybe even still off the East Coast, and this would be the rough idea for why. High pressure to the east, some high pressure to the south of the Gulf Coast, and it may kind of take that turn because of that cold front and trough of low pressure moving in this weekend. So for us, we will have about a 40% chance for a few scattered storms this weekend due to that trough of low pressure and cool front over the southeast U.S. And of course, we'll keep our eye on that potential tropical cyclone, which will probably soon be tropical storm Isaias. We'll have more updates coming all week, of course, on that. April? Yeah, thanks very much.